Hello and welcome to Level 2 Song, Time With Your Side. I'm Mike Pearson and I'll be teaching you how to play a song. The style of the song is like a blues rock, mainly blues. You have um, a nice shuffle rhythm in there, a uh, pentatonic scale. Uh, we'll be looking at other techniques such as palm muting, hammer ons, uh, pull offs, uh, sliding off some power chords, different power chord shapes. I'll play throughout the first little bit then. Okay, so that 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 bend there is on the third fret. So this is the uh, the last note of the second bar on the third fret of the A string, and you can see the arrow on the tablature um, pointing upwards, and it's got a full written above it. That means we're going to be bending this note up to this note, which is one tone or two frets. So we want to make this note sound like this note by bending it. You're going to be on G5, which is here. First finger is going on the, the thickest string, lowest E string at the third fret. You have your third finger on the A string, fifth fret, and your little finger on the fifth fret of the D string. You only want to play those three. And again, like the previous power chords, I'm going to mute the strings I don't want to put here. So with my first finger, I'm fretting the low string, but I'm also going to place it on the higher strings as well. So, so they're muted once I, when I'm strumming. So, so you only hear the lowest three strings. And if you play the first note, the first uh, open A string, as a downstroke, and then play the third fret of the lowest string, up stroke, open A string as a down stroke, back to the third fret of the E string as an up stroke. So you go down, hammer, pull off, up, down, up. That'll make it easier when you come back to doing the shuffle rhythm again, because that starts on a down stroke. Use your third finger, like I did before. Use your third finger for the bend. It's another quarter tone bend again. So a lot of this is very similar now. Bend it slightly. So you're gonna go, that bar will sound like this. That's gonna take us to the next bar, which is E5. Again, just move your first two fingers up onto the A and D strings. Okay, the last three notes. Of that bar, we're going back to triplets again. <laughs> 